Well, folks, it looks like the uh, camera decided to turn itself off, so we'll have to do this in two, as two videos. But uh, about 30 minutes has gone by. This is uh, dried up nicely. Got still, it's 80 degrees down here in Texas, and fairly dry at that. So. What I'm going to do now is, is sand it up a little bit with the 400. All this is doing is just, just knocking any of the grain that's stood up. When I am sanding a piece, I normally sand it rather fast. And I'll start all my sanding in reverse. Uh, when you, the tools and that, the gouges, have actually laid the, the, the fibers of the wood down. So I've found that sanding in reverse stands them back up and it makes it a Make sanding go just a little bit, bit faster. I'll, I'll, I'll alternate between forward and reverse. Ah, that feels pretty good. Got the, the points. saying this is just going to be for for display and not really used for feed I'm just going to use straight up oil inseed oil Now the now the grain is really showing out. The chatoins that the wood has got in it is really starting to show. You do get a little bit of bleed out. That is really no big problem. converted what was a uh, rather plain dreary looking bowl into something that's rather pleasing to the eye well pleasing to my eye anyway so Could have done, lay it up, and then blended another colour in, and and 
just lay it all three colours solid. But I prefer the the spotchy look. The spotchy look is kind of a little bit more natural effect to the to the wood. Oh, there's the, the chatoyance that has came out, come out. I'll bring in a little bit closer for a final look. Right, you can see how the, the, the grain is now really standing out in it. Some more of the chatoyance just there. And here the, the grain pattern. Which, if I'd have left it without staining it, and just put a finish on it, you, none of that grain pattern probably would have stood out the way that it's standing out now. Alright folks, uh, thanks for watching, I hope you've enjoyed it, I hope that you've got a couple of ideas on how to do some stoning, uh, please subscribe, uh, I've got a lot more ideas for videos to, to put up uh, as far as turning goes, so once again thanks for watching and Bye for now, folks.